hi everyone my name is sharon so god is saying that they are going to discover it too late that you were the gold mine that they played with their chances they played with a great opportunity they should have held on to you you know sometimes i see people who find great favor they start something and it seems to do so well but they just decide to discard it and start something else and try other things they leave that particular thing that could have worked for them or other people you find that they are in such great relationships they are in a great loving relationship the person that they are with loves them so much but they decide to leave that particular person in pursuit for someone else and decide to go after someone else who now comes and treats them so badly and you ask yourself why did they have to let go of such a person why did they have to let go of such a thing or they leave a great job to go take up a job that's even worse off you're like but why did they make such a decision so god is also saying in your life when opportunities present themselves to you when you strike upon the right opportunity he will give you the eyes to see that this is right this is what you need to be dwelling on this is where you need to be enhancing things giving it your energy because some people god he gives them great opportunities but they don't make use of those great opportunities they don't see that that was a once in a lifetime opportunity and it might not come back again so when an opportunity comes may god see may god give you the eyesight to see that this is indeed something good that this is indeed something good the same way the woman you know the shunamite woman when she saw elisha she spotted that there is something good about this man that this is a man of god let's house him let's build a room for him and what happened when she identified that he was good and she was investing in him allowing him to come and sleep there every time or having a meal there every time he was around what happened she now found the fruit of her womb god opened up the fruit of her womb and gave her a son so god is also saying in your life he wants to open up your eyes so that when opportunities do come when things pass by so that you don't miss them in the mighty name of jesus and god is also saying that yes some of you you are the gold mine certain people miss their opportunity with you played with you they discarded you they did not know that they won't find something better than that they did not know that had they invested in you had they spent time in you you would have even blossomed into something greater it would have even translated into prosperity in their lives they would have also blossomed into better visions of themselves just by being with you just by accepting accepting you in their in their spaces accepting you in their environments in their organization god is saying that you are not just an ordinary person there's something there's greatness in you there's anointing in you remember joseph in the bible joseph had the anointing of god upon his life everywhere he went everything he touched it prospered when he was in the house of potiphar everything under his care prospered when he was in prison everything in prison prospered now when he went and to work with the king with king pharaoh the king also prospered so you could see the anointing was in him he was the gold mine so god is also saying that you are the gold mine in the mighty name of jesus and those who put you close to them they are going to be flourishing so stop undermining yourself stop underestimating yourself because you are one in a million there's something different about you there's something special about you in the mighty name of jesus Amen.